Salut! Dans cette vidéo, je vais révéler mon secret pour parler couramment la langue française. En plus, vous découvrirez la méthode que j'ai utilisée pour atteindre le niveau B2 en français, ainsi que le plan que vous devez élaborer afin de structurer votre processus d'apprentissage. Comme auparavant, la vidéo se déroulera en anglais, mais vous pouvez utiliser des sous-titres dans plus de 20 langues. C'est parti! This video is for those of you who already have some basics in French or for those of you who already speak any Romans language other than French. Hence, I will share step-by-step -step plan that made me fluent in French in the following minutes. But if you stay long enough, I will share with you the bonus tip that will make your journey towards fluency even faster. French counts into the group of the languages that are closely related to English. Thus, if we assume that you already speak English and if we take into consideration the traditional way of learning foreign languages, the assessment is that you would need around 600 hours in order to become really good in French. However, if you take into consideration the approach that I used, you'll probably need even less time and what's even better is it will be much more fun for you. Hence, the natural approach that I used in order to become fluent in French is based on two methods that are oriented toward input and can easily be adapted to your current level of French, whether this is a very beginner or intermediate level that is lacking fluency. Let's dive into them. Evidence for the value of free voluntary reading or recreational reading is clear and omnipresent. In the last few decades, evidence from several areas continues to show that those who do more recreational reading show better development in reading, writing, grammar and vocabulary. These results hold for any form of second language acquisition and for both children and adults. Guys, it's not only some scientific data. I can as well confirm amazing positive effects from free voluntary reading on the level of my French. Study after study done in the last three decades confirmed that self-selected reading for pleasure without book reports or other forms of accountability result in profound growth in nearly all aspects of literacy. In fact, the research data is so strong that it may be accurate to say that free voluntary reading is the only sure way that learners will develop enough literacy and knowledge in order to master the language. But the catch is that free voluntary reading only works if you understand what you read. Therefore, we will divide our reading activities into the three following categories depending on your current level of French. Hence, the first step that you should do when you have basic knowledge is to start reading materials in French that are super easy to understand. Even if you are at A1 level, there is one sort of content that you can read and understand easily. I used to use this sort of content when I started learning French many years ago and it is easy to find this content for free on internet. What makes this type of content easy to understand is the visual effect and short paragraphs. Besides, why I believe that this is the great starting point is because these short books have compelling stories that will keep you engaged and make you think you're not reading in the foreign language. If you haven't guessed yet, I'm talking about comic books. When I started working on my French, I used to read one of the most famous French comic books called Asterix and Obelix and I expanded my vocabulary a lot. Besides, there are other comic books written in French that are amazing and can be easily found online such as Lucky Luke, Smurfs, Blake, uh, Mortimer, Gaston, etc. If you are at the point where you can understand short sentences, 
meaning that you already built the basic vocabulary, I highly recommend you to find literature that is written in easy French. This is the best way to progress for juniors because you will use the understandable content that is written in selected amount of words. These are usually written for specific levels such as A1, A2, B1, B2, etc. So you can easily try to read at any of these levels and see whether it is suitable for you. The cool thing is that all these books have interesting plots and many new words are explained with photos. By using these easy French books, you can read some masterpieces of the French literature that would be too difficult for you to understand if read in original version. Furthermore, all these books are very short, around 50 to 60 pages and they will keep you engaged. I have literally read dozens of them in previous year. Thus, reading easy French books will help you boost your skills in the language and in this way you will memorize words in the context which is proven to be the most effective way. If you are at the point where you can understand the vast majority of the content that you read but you still feel you're not fluent, I got great news, you're almost there. At this point, it is the easiest to find compelling material. You just need to be a bit adventurous and do a brief research. Think about the areas of your interest and explore them in French. Since I love history, I started reading this amazing journal called Le Secret d'Histoire. But you can use books, magazines, online newspapers and any other content that is easy for you to find. Where most of the language learners make mistake is when they simply persist to read the chosen content at every price. Thus, if the material that you're reading turns to be too complex or too boring for you, just put it down and find something better to read. In order to acquire French, it's not only enough to understand what you read, you have to be absorbed by the content as well. You will know when this happens because reading will become very pleasant for you. Evidence shows that audio comprehensible input plays a critical role in all stages of language acquisition. Results indicate that listening to the language is very helpful in improving comprehension, fluency, vocabulary, and increasing your confidence with the language. Thus, focused listening in French for you will have critical impact on your skills in the language through variety of aspects. First, it provides a great deal of input which is made comprehensible through repetition, self-selection of content and familiarity with the topics. Second, it allows you to acquire in the environment where tension is minimal or there are no specific requests to answer or immediate feedback you should worry about. Finally, it gives you the opportunity to proceed at your your own pace and when you feel so. Just as free voluntary reading, the focused listening only works if we understand what we hear, therefore we will divide our listening activities into three categories as well depending on your current level of French. Getting used to the sounds of the language and the system of pronunciation is the cornerstone towards reaching fluency in the language, but how to make the input comprehensible when you are still a baby listener? Well, the best method is to combine sounds with visual effect which can make make them understandable. I prefer combining these two so that I could benefit from both getting the context of the language and retaining the interest in the content. There is absolutely no doubt that more you get understandable messages in the target language, more you would actually acquire and preserve. That's why the visual effect plays such an important role while learning foreign languages. And there is no better place 
place for baby listeners to acquire French language in this way than YouTube. On YouTube you will be able to find a wide variety of channels in French that are both interesting and comprehensible. Some of the recommendations you can find in this video as a bonus tip. Thus, if you want to know which are my favorite YouTube channels that you can follow in order to boost your French, you should watch the video above. Some of these YouTube channels are easy to understand even if you are a beginner and YouTube is user-friendly so you can slow down the pace of the video if it is too fast for you to follow or use the captions while watching. When you already have some level of proficiency in French, I highly recommend you to try acquiring the language by watching some French movies or TV shows. Some of my favorite French movies of all time are Le Pacte de Lou, Taxi, que vous pouvez me sauver la vie? A priori, no. and La Haine. You will easily immerse yourself in the content and forget it is in French by choosing to watch a movie or series that are covering the topic of your interest. What is key beside understanding is making sure that you are enjoying watching the content. If you think that it is too difficult for you to understand, feel free to turn on the French subtitles. Movies and series usually contain a bunch of modern phrases and slang, so by using the captions you can make the words easier to recognize. Letting yourself get carried away by your interest is vital for learning French in this way. If you can understand a lot sounds of the French language but you still feel you're not ready to speak, try listening to the French radio stations. I use this app on my phone to get access to a number of French radio stations. You can do it from your PC as well. My favorite radio station is RFI Radio, where I can listen to all different topics and current state of affairs in Francophone countries and in the rest of the world as well. By listening to the radio, you will expose yourself to different accents, speaking speeds and topics. But Keep this exercise for the end of your journey since there is no visual effect that would facilitate your understanding of the language. Bearing in mind that these two methods are now clarified, all you need to boost your French is to establish a daily routine and surround yourself with the language. Remember that learning the language is a marathon rather than a sprint. Therefore, try to implement some of the mentioned activities every day. And guys, if you like this channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification button so you don't miss the next video. Also, if you have any relevant topic or an issue that you would love to hear about, let me know in the comments below. And see you in some of the next videos. Bye!